tired and horny. The, the two most common... I'm just sitting here outside admiring this hard cut of sunlight perfectly shaped onto this one piece of plant. It's cinematography, right? I've been listening to all this uh, uh, Roger Deacon's podcast. Right here in this spot is where I normally listen to it. And I'm usually out here in the morning, but right now we're getting this hard late afternoon sun and it's coming from a completely opposite direction and it just uh, lights this tree gives it a backlight and just completely illuminates this plant right here perfectly and there's this building here that's giving the rest of the plants a hard cut nice blocking so it's just shaping the light perfectly right onto this one plant and then you know, obviously it spills over here onto the street but we can pretend we're not seeing that but yeah beautiful the light but yeah I'm just getting ready for my um, my what do I call this accountability group with Nami and Sarah and uh, yeah about to just go over our stuff from last week and jump into this week uh, I'm going over some notes right now for this new thing that I'm writing which is uh, pilot and uh, yeah, I feel pretty good about the idea and I feel pretty good about the process that I've had so far. Just sort of uh, taking very, very deliberate notes off of references. So yeah, trying to piece it together, piece my puzzle together to tell this story. Um, yeah. Oh, so the news now being that Nicole and I are most likely going to be heading to New Jersey for June 16th, from June 16th until mid-July, so about a month. So that'll be, that'll be cool. It's, we're both looking forward to it. Go and sort of enjoy some uh, summertime over on the east coast with some family and not have to worry about too much and you know nothing's really going on here uh, work-wise for either of us during the summer for me I mean there's always things to be working on but like you know I remember as of last summer I didn't really have many auditions during uh, June and July everything started coming in more so um, in the fall and the winter so and you know there's things going on in the summer obviously but uh, I can tape now I can tape from anywhere so with the virus and all that like taping is basically what the audition world is going to be turning into so I've been practicing that a lot and I'm sure I'll have to tape while I'm gone um, but yeah Nicole obviously is off of uh, school, so she's got the summertime. And yeah, we're gonna go back east, go chill, and I'm gonna work on my new project. That's all I really. I have a few things that I wrote down, and uh, you know, I'm sure I'll figure a few more things out of what I want to focus my um, uh, planning on. But most of it will be this. Um, this series here that I'm trying to get going so yeah onward and upward all right I'll talk to you later what up it's Thursday May 21st and yeah I'm just uh, sitting here about to practice some drums, some rudiments on the practice pad, and uh, some beats probably, just play around on what I have here, and let's see, 
Yeah, I'm actually pretty excited that I, I've been working on a new pilot and uh, something I've never actually done before, which is write a about a 60-page pilot. Um, so yeah, basically just got the first like scene. I have one scene and I have... Um, the teaser so I kind of know where I'm going to some extent um, but yeah I'm excited with uh, the ideas that I have and also the way that I've been formatting it so yeah so far so good excited about it can't wait till I get to 60 pages I've never actually done that so uh, that would be a big feat for me to conquer. And I feel like that's sort of the thing that's going to be prominent in my creative life for the next few months, probably, I would assume. Or at least I would guess. But I'll, and I'm sure I'll be working on this for a lot longer, but I'm thinking that I'll start developing this series, have a pilot, and maybe an episode or or two after that or treatments for the season uh, it's probably what I'll end up doing so yeah that's the summer also I have booked flights to New Jersey so I'm officially going and we are talking about doing a trip to Yosemite for Nicole's 30th and also potentially going to a Arizona for my 31st in November because I spoke to my dad today and he said he'll be back in the States for right around that time my birthday so yeah the next few months we've got some stuff on the calendar which is cool always good and yeah just we'll see what happens looking forward to going back to Jersey and spending some time just kind of chilling meditating not worrying about anything at all uh just going to be writing so that's exciting to me studying that's that'll be that'll consume a lot of my life is studying having a routine and writing it's a lot of stuff for me at least and hopefully music and a couple other things i don't know we'll see so yeah that's it